jump scare alert. Woman can't even edit a YouTube video at 12 o'clock in the morning without Splatoon news. We like literally just got a Splatfest and they're like, hey guys, here's Final Fest. Or really, they're calling it the Grand Festival this time, which is fun. And the art is so pretty. I've seen a little bit of the information about the fest, but I evaded watching the trailer because I wanted to record watching the trailer because I feel like that makes sense to like be able to yap about it. First of all, before we even click on the trailer though, I, I already I already saw these the these gorgeous amiibos. Oh no! <laughs> Into the collection they go. <laughs> They're so good, dude. I I I I don't even want to imagine the amount of like intricacy they probably have to put into Marie's brella. Hello. Hi. And then the gold like splash for Pearl and the silver splash for Marina. Ugh. Ugh, I'm gonna be sick. I'm gonna be sicker than I am being up at almost 1 a.m. to see this all go down. Dude, how sparkly do you think her tentacles are gonna be? Like on her head. Am I gonna lose my mind? I might, I might, I might lose my mind. Like the fact they have the side order fits. Ugh. Ugh. And then the fact that the outfits for like the regular, it's like, it's so order vibe. Listen, Team Order might have lost the Splatfest, but Team Order is winning here. We're clicking on the link now. Let me in. Let me in, please. Please let me in. Oh, I need volume. I need volume. Oh my God. Okay, let me in. Starfish main stage looking thing here. We're in the middle of nowhere and it's so cute. <laughs> Do, do we get to keep the little blobbies on us the whole time? Ooh, ooh, the remix! Oh, oh my god, I, okay, I, I won't go back. I'm not gonna pause first. They're gay, your honor. Look at them. Oh, 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 <laughs> this big man's fit. Bro's gonna slap you down like a pancake and like get you with the spikes. <laughs> Woo! Oh. Oh, please tell me we can watch like the in game concert. They can't like tease us with this and then not let us watch it. Oh. Oh, it's beautiful. Fellas, it's the Now or Never 7. Oh. Ooh. <laughs> oh man. I I did see on Twitter the theme is would you do you care most about the past? I have a tear in my eye. About the past, the present, or the future? I think we have to be future gaming. I think we have to be future gaming. I'm I'm on my hands and knees asking the video game nicely. Please make the colors like like this bright red and this blue and this green and not like dark red blurple and guacamole down here please <laughs> very appreciative of nintendo by the way for giving this very easy to swipe logo here i'm, I'm just gonna yoink that for later <laughs> okay now we're going back and like staring at stuff though because we like have to i don't know i feel like this is a different font from the usual in-game font it just it like catches me off guard it it's it's not starfish though. It, it looks like starfish main stage on like the first setup. It makes me like want to play Splatoon 2. Good thing from the time that this video comes out, Splatoon 2 turns seven years old in just a couple of days. Ah ha ha! Ooh hee hee! This is such a this is such a neat effect though. Like I I don't think there's seven different ink colors, but it still it still goes crazy. You have all like you got all the different posters. Do you have? Oh. Oh, the, the van is all of them. Ah. Uh, oh, man. I don't, I don't think this has any representation at the moment yet, which is good. But this, this whole setup here where you've got like, you know, two different ink colors to kind of represent yourself like coming out of a battle or something is, it's kind of awesome. That slaps. And this, this is gorgeous. Like, this is just the key art they have. Like, but what if we just make it, what if we just make it go crazy? Look at them. 
Look at them hold hands. Oh my god, the fits. The order fits. They're, yeah. Ga. A ga ga. A wa ba ba. A wa ba. And then it like cuts them and they're like fun fits dancing. They, they, they just have so. Who gave them all these spikes? They, they spend too much time. <laughs> too much time on that. Oh, is, is Pearl wearing an octopi hat? Okay, no, I don't, I can't, I, I can't, I can't tell. My, my brain is mush. I'm like, is this, I don't, I don't think it's, I don't think it's, I think it's just the off the hook symbol in my head. I'm like, did, did she, is she like supporting her girly like that too? Oh boy. Oh boy. Oh, and Marina's fit. Oh man. Dude, the, the cosplayers are going to be eating all of this up. Oh. Oh, I love I the and the the stupid spikes are so good. The way like Deep Cut like has come to like embrace each other here in this picture, how like closely, like they're hugging each other. It's so good. Look how bright like Fry's tentacles are in not the tentacles the like Fry's hands are here in particular. That's crazy. Oh, the red looks so good on them, though. I'm sick. I'm ill. <laughs> I'm still thinking about Big Man's spikes and how, like, hard they can crush you, though. <laughs> I really hope that you can, like... All they gotta do is, like, let you use the amiibo to, like, watch the concert afterward. Come on. Come on. Amiibo functionality. Bring back the concerts. You know you wanna. You know you wanna. You know you want this. This forever. And not just locked to three days, please. Ooh, you know you want it so bad. Although I will be here. I'm I'm gonna be recording. I'm gonna be recording. I can't lose out on having this forever. Man, oh man. And they make it very clear. They call it the Grand Festival and not the Final Fest. Which does give me some hope for getting some delicious, yumbly, post-Grand Splatfest Extra Fests. Like maybe another, another Frosty Fest. Another spooky fest could be the same exact theme. Like, with how things have changed, the results could still be different. If you have too many people that just throw themselves at the team that they assume is gonna win, and they don't play appropriately, there could be a flipping. I mean, you know, Big Man did win all of those fests, so there would be a lot of people out there that I think would love to see a different result. This... This theme, I'm kind of, is kind of making me ill, though. I, I get it. I really, really do. And I still think that I'm gonna end up being a team future gamer. Like, I can't really be a team past gamer. I think the past is really good for like nostalgia. You know, nostalgia, good. Nostalgia, great. But I can't see myself seeding myself like, like just in the past. You know. I'm a person who always really likes to look into the future. And I'm just gonna have this like footage running in the background like while I yap because I want to stare at it with my own two eyes and like not be able to fall asleep until 2 a.m. after recording this even though you won't get this video until the morning when I wake up and upload it because uploading at 1 a.m. is... I don't, I don't know about that one. Maybe I should. Maybe I should. I probably won't though. I'm probably gonna... Girl's gonna probably go to bed. <laughs> You'll find out though. I'll find out too. Oh, uh, dude, and the music goes crazy! Like, do you think they'll make more songs? Do you think we'll get this soon? Like, the tune? We're just gonna have to sit here and like, wait it out. But okay, it's ser it's ser it's seriously though, seriously though. I'm definitely like between present and future, right? And in my brain, I'm like, well, I did join Team Order last time. I picked the futuristic team. And you know what? We got kind of clobbered. And I think I'm partly joining Team Future a little bit for revenge. <laughs> Will we win? Oh, but it's it's fun like that, you know? Also, I feel like Deep Cut's outfits are just are just also really fun. So like, uh, you know, I kind of maybe 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 that makes me go ooh ah. But like, oh, they but all their outfits, all their outfits are so good. And it's a great it's, it's a great send-off for what Splatoon 3 has been. This, like, celebration at this point 
of all three games. Like, Splatoon 2 is so, like, it's self-contained within Marina and Pearl's shenanigans, at least, like, as the game comes to a close. But Splatoon 3, as the, like, as the DLCs has went on, have purposely, like, brought back everybody. We've had, like, the interview recently where it brought in all of the idols again. And on this concert, they're all very purposely here, that's so you think about all of them. The only, I mean, the only idols not getting Amiibos, it seems like, for this festival is Deep Cut, because they just came out in this game. Oops. But, like, they've taken the time to bring back these characters, and it's, it's really great to see. I'm sure there'll be plenty of people that have a hard time picking between this one. I, I, I almost think I have an easier time saying, yeah, I want to be on Team Future than I do for the freaking... Starch food splat fest. Like I can't, I can't pick a food. Every time I think about the splat fest, it makes me hungry. But this splat fest, I see the theme, and I'm like, you know what? Yeah, I can, I, I can kind of dig the idea of being on Team Future. I wish the comments were turned on. That's so I could like go down there and immediately start typing like, I am going to puke. What is this slash positive or something? Cause oh my oh. It's 1.02 a.m. I'm gonna spend however much money is needed to get my hands on this little bracelet right here. It's available in the JP store, but I'm not sure we'll get it, but oh, Nintendo, ooh. You wanna bring it to Nintendo and why? I'll drive the hour and a half. I will go and get it, please. And that doesn't even get us started on like, what this even means for the future of the game, if anything at all. Cause like, Chaos versus Order led up to deciding a lot of the stuff regarding like, the DLC for example. But what do they, what do they do here, right? <laughs> I've seen all kinds of things, like people being like, but what if it's a Splatoon 1 remake? And I, I don't know about that, but that is, that is funny. That is funny, but I'm assuming it would have to do with, I don't know, maybe, maybe it could be based on like, where we go next in the timeline? That'd be really interesting. We already know that there's a decent chance that the Squid Beak Splatoon is done, right? Like, after Splatoon 3? And following the story of other individuals would be really enjoyable. It'd be interesting to see where it ends up. But, I don't know, man. This... It's all mystery! <laughs> It's just, the art is so high quality. Look at them, look at them all. Hold hands. Oh man. Dude, the, the connection, the love, the game. We've just, we've built something great here in the last, you know, over nine years this franchise has had video games functioning. And don't you want to, you know, listen, I'm going to, I'll advertise for future. Don't you want to be inspired and think of the future? of Splatoon, even beyond Splatoon 3, the matches you'll play even in Splatoon 3 that come in the future, the friends you might make, the tournaments you might play in, the journey that you're going to be going on in Splatoon and outside of Splatoon. I, I think Team Future is kind of on top, so obviously you're going to go in the comments and you're going to tell me that you're joining Team Future, right? Right? Mm-hmm. Mm-hmm. See you September the 12th, 13th-ish. I don't know what time it's gonna actually start here. <laughs> I, I'm assuming it's gonna be like Thursday into the end of Sunday. But maybe it's maybe it's Friday into the end of Monday. I'm assuming it's probably Thursday into Sunday. We'll, we'll find out. We'll find out. Bye-bye. I'm not gonna be able to sleep now. Ha-ha! <laughs>